This is Master Cloud. You can see we have a list of projects here. We'll go ahead and click on one. This is going to give us an overview of our project. You can see we have a list of uh, deployments, and these are atomic deployments of our agents and workflows. This project has an agent, it has a workflow. You can see when it was created, you can see environment variables for this project, and I can actually access the URL for this project. Let's go ahead and take a look at this last deployment. You can see we have logs here. We can also take a look at our agent. In this case, we have a weather agent. And we can communicate directly with our agent through here. That way we can test it. You can see this is using Anthropic. It has a tool and it has a system prompt here. So we'll just ask about the weather. And you can see it returns back a response. Let's go ahead and look at the trace for this. We can see the last trace was this stream. You can see it ran this stream text. If I go into this, you can see what was requested. You can see that it made a tool call. And if I go down here, you can see the results of all of this. So I can see that it made a tool call here. Here was the actual results of the tool call. So I can really dig in and see what's going on uh, with the agent anytime I communicate with it or anytime I try to get the weather. Let's look at the workflows. There's one workflow. And you can see this workflow is just two steps. It it's a workflow that allows us to fetch the weather and then call an agent to plan activities. And that's Master Cloud. You can get your atomic deployments for your agents for your workflows. You can see the traces for any time anyone communicates with your workflow through whatever application. You can access all of this through an API, and you can deploy it instantly.